Oh, well, looks like I'm involved in the back and forth with a fucking goon from Doncaster. So, why did you feel the need to go in on me there and disrespect me? Because you're too scared to fight me. I messaged you in private about fighting. You took, you went straight to YouTube as a reply. I messaged you in private. That's You call yourself a fighting man. You know, we could have arranged a fight in private. See, what you've done is, Brett, you took it to YouTube so you could so you don't look like a shit house because you don't want to fight me. That's, that's the real reason, Brett. You don't want to fight. Simple as that. Now, you've gone in on me, getting personal, talking about certain situations that, that I removed myself from because I, I see this house. This is my kingdom. I have a wife and kids. I don't run around the streets thinking I'm a certified bad man. You know, I don't run around the streets putting, putting my family at risk, thinking I'm going to go to jail. I've done all that. I've been all that. I've been shot and stabbed at, you fucking crank. So, <coughs> you're, you, listen, Brett, you, you're a certified knobhead, is what you are. You want to go, you want to come on YouTube and disrespect me after I message you in private, respectfully, and ask for, and I, ask, I nicely asked you to fight. You know, you made a video on YouTube saying, I'm the baddest man, I'm this, I'm that. Anyone in this corner of YouTube can have it. Now, I put it on you, you flapped it. You already knew I was fighting in June on the BKFC. You shit yourself. You didn't want to fight. You don't want to fight someone of my calibre because I'll punch your skull in. You can't live with me, pal. You can't live with me. You know, boxing and combat sport has been all my life. That's what I've did all my life. All my life. You're just a fucking wannabe fighter. You're a clown. You, 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 listen, anyone with half a brain only needs to watch you in the bag and jumping around like a fool knows that you aren't on my level. You can have all your little minions and all these cranks and fucking whoppers in your comment section telling you that you're going to do me. Come do it. Come do it. I'll meet you any time, any place, anywhere. And I'll have it with you. Not a problem. Now, you want to talk about personal things, you know, that I, was, that I excluded myself from. Do you want me to start talking about personal stuff? I have a lot of friends in Doncaster. I know boys in Doncaster. I have a lot of pals in Doncaster. And don't give it the big and saying you'll walk through Doncaster and you do it because you then go through Doncaster. Because I know... I know the truth, Barrett. Now, if this is what you want to do here, if you want to go back and forth, not a fucking problem, because I will open you up, you stupid fat cunt. Listen, you're a fucking clown. You're a muppet. You had no reason to do that to me there. You had no reason to go in on me there and start talking about my, my family and the, my choices and what I chose to do. You know, Brett, I'm a real man. I've been a fantasist like you before. I've lived on them streets. I've been in and out of jails. I've done all that, mate. It, it's the coward's way of living. It's a shit house way of living. It's a fantasy world that you're living in. You're the clown, mate. The real men get up on the morning, provide for the family. They be there for the wife and kids. I've got a wife, a beautiful, loyal wife, and three beautiful kids that I will give my life for in an instant. You are a fucking goon. You're out for yourself. You're giving it gun fingers and you're fucking stupid pineapple head. You're a fucking whopper, mate. There was no need for you to do this today, Brett. You got I've been trying to get in touch with you in private for all day. All day. Answer your Instagram. I've been trying to FaceTime you. I've been trying to answer your Instagram. Why have you chose to do this on YouTube? I do not know. I messaged you in private about fighting. And you took to YouTube. My reply to Paul Venice. You didn't need to reply to me on YouTube. You should have replied to me in a message. That's what you should have done. Should have got back to me privately in a message. Now, if you want to sort this out on private... We can sort this out in private. I don't give two fucks for you, Brett. You're a fat divvy, and I will punch your skull in. You cannot fight me, mate. I'll sleep you. It easy. You are light work for me. Light work. Listen, I'm not being funny, mate, and I mean no disrespect when I say this to Rob Cunningham, who I love dearly, and is a big friend of mine, and I like him, and he's a good friend of mine. He will beat you 10 times out of 10, 100%, and I will beat Rob Cunningham 10 times out of fucking 10. So I'll beat you a hundred times out of a hundred. You fucking idiot. Now, let me calm down a sec. So I have got people, since me and you had this back and forth, I have got messages about you from women, from men, from people from Doncaster telling me what you are and what you how you roll and the things that you get up to. Now, do you want me to start talking about them and putting the proof out there now? You want me to start doing this? You want to do this back and forth on YouTube, man? I've got no fucking problem. In fact, I'm in Doncaster, February, Fest. Do you want to fucking... Listen, when I come to Doncaster, mate, I'm in Doncaster on the February Fest. I'm seeing a few of my pals down there. Now, let me know if you want to meet up on the Fest of February because I'll come and I'll meet you. You bring one man, I'll bring one man and I'll punch your fucking skull in. You fat, ugly, pineapple-headed cunt.